Hello, welcome to Intersoft Solution Tutorial Video. This video will show you on how to perform a fly postback action. First, create a new website using Visual Studio 2008 application. Then, switch to Design View, create a simple div, and add two radio buttons. After that, we can drag web button to the web form. It will automatically register the entire resources assemblies of Intersoft components at a time. Then, we will need to drag web fly post back manager as well. Next, create a new web form in the same route and named it as web form listener.aspx. Right click on that file and choose view code. It will direct us to its .cs file. In here, we will need to add a listener object, and create a simple fly postback method. After that, go back to our default .aspx file, and add text to web button with call web form. Set the width to 120 pixels, and add a new client side event handler of on client click. In here, we will need some code to get the object of web fly post back manager, and call the method that we have declared in the server side. Next, go to design view and change the service URL of web fly post back manager from its property. Choose on web form listener.aspx. Then, we add a new handler for a client side event of on response success, and add a simple alert function of JavaScript to indicate if the fly post back is succeed. Finally, you can save and run the project. Click on the web button to perform a fly post back action. With simple settings, you can now easily perform a fly post back action. Thank you for watching Intersoft Solution tutorial video. For further information, you can visit our website at www.intersoftpt.com.